First off, before we do anything, we would love to give it up for OTC for hosting this amazing okay. event. Please. Yeah. This is a massive event and we are so happy to be a part of it. Uh, we got in yesterday, we saw some great teams, you guys have seen some great teams, and now it is our turn. We are the Revengers, Age of Improv. Uh, catch us when the next movie comes out, we will be Civil Improv. <laughs> so, what we have prepared for you tonight, uh, this this little bit. The rest Nothing's of prepared, part, Eric! This part is, because it's special. This is issue one of one, presented strictly to Cedar, right here. Issue number one of an origin story that we have yet to do. So, to get us started, uh, who's got something coming up soon? Birthday, anniversary? 21st! 21st? Wait, we have a 21st? Yeah. Where is our 21? It's all the way in the back. Hello. 21, come on up. Come on up. Come on up. Excellent. 21 years old? Uh, soon, yeah. Soon. Uh, how soon? Two weeks. Two weeks, I'll take it. Excellent. What's your name? Staff. It's Michael. 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 Staff. All right, Justin, you got the whiteboard right? I got the whiteboard. Do it. All right, Michael. Uh, we are going to create an origin character right now with your help. So, uh, through uh, Bakersfield, through our three issues, we've gotten Thor, cool. we've gotten Deadpool, etc. Cool. I want you to reach into the back of your mind, and I want you to pick out your favorite superhero character that you think other people don't like popularly. <laughs> no, just like when you think like top five that people know, I want mm. you to I want you to dig a little bit deeper. Think that number right. six. Think that number six. That number six. Who's our number six? Um, the dude from Super. The you know, dude the from Super. Yeah. The uh, the Crimson Wrench. He walks around and whacks people. Played by Rain Wilson, right? Yep. Okay. Right. Excellent. What, what is your favorite? What what makes him your favorite? Gives me one major quality. Uh, his blatant disregard for the safety of others. That'll do it. All right. <laughs> Excellent. So we'll take a seat. That's all we needed from Michael. So we've all read comic books, so you know how like we always have a trope, like Batman, his parents are dead. Sorry if I ruined anybody's story, it happens early on. Spoilers! Uh, <laughs> three pages in. So what's like a big trope that happens in comic books? Girlfriend in distress. Girlfriend in distress. Alright, and then uh, we just need just some random word, phrase, just something. I heard scarf. Scarf. <laughs> Scarf. So what we have is we have the Crimson Wrench, blatant disregard of others, girlfriend in distress. I put GF for girlfriend. Take and it. Scarf. Beautiful. Blatant disregard of others. Excellent. Okay. All right. Let's get our cover painted. Yep. Uh, all right. Here we see a man walking away from an explosion that's going on behind him. There are people that are obviously <laughs> caught in this explosion, and you can see. Like uh, um, a uh, like pathway of um, gunpowder that leads from here, and it's been spent, and it leads to the explosion. Uh, Revengers number one point one. Revengers, Revengers is assemble! Assemble! Hoping you were gonna say no. Well, you asked it. <laughs> you asked it in a way that made it sound like you were really hoping I did not. I was on the pill. That I was on the pill. I, I'm on the pill. I don't think we're working on the same wavelength, Sally. I, I'm a thrill we're seeker. Not. I'm a daredevil. I like to live life on the edge. I wanted you to not be on the pill so I can feel the thrill of being alive. So I, maybe we're gonna have a kid. Maybe we're not. I, Do you even know when you're yeah. ovulating? <laughs> yes. When? Yes, I do. When? Is it now? No, it's Is not it? now. That would have made it so much more exciting. <laughs> Come on, baby. I don't want a kid. You know, the mood's kind of ruined. So, I'm going to go ahead and go. <laughs> what if I say I'm sorry? That's not really going to fix it now. <laughs> I have nothing in my life without you. Oh, I'm so attracted to you suddenly. I'm going to leave. You have a good night. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> and we go see my parents. 
We have to tell your parents this isn't gonna happen? No, no, we're still dating. I'm just not. We gonna... are? Yeah. I have so much more hope than I did two sentences ago. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't feel like having sex right now. I still gotta make it through a shift before I see your parents. Yeah. Have fun with that. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a good shift. Love you. I miss you. Watch out, I still haven't changed the light bulb in the stairwell. I'll be fine. I've been here a couple. <laughs> Sorry! I dropped my keys! Hey boss. How's it going? I'm good. You hear that? I did. I don't know about you, Ratcliffe, but <laughs> nothing pleases my eyes more than an empty city. Yeah, Bart Thug, come on, let's go get him. Let's go attack. What are we gonna do, the ice cream man? We're gonna hold up the ice cream man tonight. Cool, I could go for a Ninja Turtle ice cream pop. <laughs> I, I don't like the bubblegum part. <laughs> chin, 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 chin. Chin, 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 chin. Give us your money! was one pool of light that the ice cream man walked into being it's 11 o'clock at night. <laughs> I, I don't have... I'll much. cut you! Oh! I don't have much, mostly small change. That's your money, I want it! <laughs> Please don't hurt me, I have... Why is it... Oh! See. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! Now you go, and you tell everyone you know that Ratcliffe and Bart Thug <laughs> this is our turf! <laughs> that this is our turf, and we will hold up every ice cream man, every candy man, every barber shop, every convenience store, every bank, every gas station. I think he gets the idea. Good. Spinning newspaper. <laughs> City in terror. Another spinning newspaper. <laughs> Everybody terrified. Another spinning newspaper. Ice cream on all time low. Chief. I'm alone in the chief's office. What do you want? I was just back getting get my chair repaired. Chair repair in the back of the office. No, they dropped it off in the back of the warehouse. Don't. What, what do you want? <laughs> I want the city in terror case, Chief. <laughs> I don't care anymore. My girlfriend might be leaving me. She might not. She doesn't want to have a kid with me anymore. And I've got nothing left to lose. Splash <laughs> shatters and flies forward. Hey, man, I work here. I don't care. <laughs> I'm going to have to take that out of your pay. I'm already in negatives anyway, Chief. I know. If I were to retire tomorrow, I'd be paying the city my pension. <laughs> You're like 30. You're not going to retire tomorrow. I've broken a lot of stuff. I know. <laughs> You're still... That's I want the city in terror case, Chief! Yeah, that's really and annoying. I don't care about the consequences! My daughter made that picture frame. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. I don't care. It's, we have no evidence on it right now. Yeah, I'm gonna like need a... $30,000 from the department budget so that I can check out an ice cream truck and go undercover. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'll write the check for you, Chief. No, I don't need it. We have an impound ice cream truck. We have an impounded ice cream truck. Just, like, take 40 bucks and buy ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> You don't know the value of money, do you? And I don't care. <laughs> oh, another one! Our popularity has grown! Good, good. The three of us strong will be able to take this two square mile city by storm. <laughs> Boys? You see that nuclear power plant over there? 
<laughs> yeah, it's pretty it's, large. It's, it's, it's right, yeah. I'm thinking I want to break into somewhere tonight. And I'm thinking that's the spot. <laughs> are we going to hold this city for ransom? Or you just want to break in? <laughs> Both. We're going to break in first, and then we're going to hold the city for ransom. Perfect. Good. Hold their power for ransom. That's genius! New guy. Yes. You don't have a name yet. I don't. You look like a sloth. I'll call you Slothington. Very well, sir. Perfect. <laughs> He's actually really smart, so it doesn't make sense. Oh, God. Uh, just go with it anyway. Okay. It, what's done is done, sir. All right. <laughs> I want you to break in first. Take care of any security that might be around. Ratcliffe, you're with me on the left side. We're gonna flank him, okay? Okay. <laughs> so he's going on the right. Yeah, hand. yeah, we're going on the left. It's, it's... got it. It look, was implied. Look, it if was implied. this is the power plant, it's gonna go in here. We're gonna flank him. We're gonna spread. We have a dry away. All right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, move out. Okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. The island city, two square mile motor pool of the police department. <laughs> I'm here to check out. Huh? I'm here to check out the uh, ice cream truck. That's in the back. <laughs> you want me to drive it myself? I, yeah, I, I, I can do it for you. I don't. <laughs> One of us has to get the truck. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Come on, it's just right around the back. Okay. Later in the back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, such a long walk. Well, you know. <laughs> We passed the ice cream I'm supposed to check out on the way. Well, let's go get the ice cream first. Okay. Then. Later, back in the ice cream <laughs> section, here's the check the chief signed. $4,000 worth of ice cream. <laughs> At most, this is like 40 bucks. Oh, uh, there's zeros added. Okay, man. Because nobody cares! Okay. <laughs> All right, just don't don't yell at me, okay? My nerves have been a little frazzled, okay? The, the city hasn't been safe. Has and this been properly refrigerated? Yeah. Of course. Nitroglycerin. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> now, you want to go see that ice cream shop? Yeah, let's go! Okay, later, at the, uh, later at the ice cream shop. Back after that long walk. All right. <laughs> Look, okay, she's not pretty, but but she'll get the job done. She's a beauty. <laughs> They're looking at a uh, a standard white truck. It has uh, one giant ice cream cone at the top, uh, but the ice cream on the ice cream cone is completely cracked and broken. Yes. The uh, handles are uh, have rust stains running down. Uh, three of the rims are missing with one silver hubcap. The it's car works. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of rust, pieces knocked off of it. Can I outfit that ice cream cone with a rocket launcher? <laughs> Let me put that another way. <laughs> Outfit that ice cream cone with a rocket. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, you're my superior. Let me just go back to the armory. Later at the armory. <laughs> Here's the rocket launcher. Back to the ice back cream truck. Back to the ice cream truck. <laughs> I just discovered the latent mutant power of teleportation. I didn't move and I was there and now I'm here. Oh, your legs didn't even move. My pager! <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> My ringtone! <Cell> phone. <laughs> Man, I haven't seen a pager in ages! That's because I don't care about technology at <laughs> all! <laughs> Shut up! Don't complain that it hit you in the face! Okay! <laughs> conversation. I don't pay much attention because I don't believe in consequences, even in a relationship. 
Regardless, you roll up in an ice cream truck outfitted with a rocket launcher? Well, I'm working at the same time. <laughs> oh, man. She knows what I do, it's very dangerous. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Just, look, take it from me, man. I'm not married anymore. I was married to my job first and my wife left me. Just realize, sometimes your job is going to take away everything you love. I have no ability to listen to the advice of others. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I have found my girlfriend's scarf, however, which is a sure sign that she's been kidnapped by supervillains and taken inside that nuclear plant. <laughs> the, the scarf itself is sheer with a long rose embroidered on it. I gave it to her, but I don't remember when. It was like a birthday present, but I don't know when that is. Well, hey, let me help you. I'm, I'm, I'm always stuck at the compound. I didn't pass the police test or anything. I've, I've been itching to get out. I mean. You're in. <laughs> you know I've only got like a taser and handcuffs, right? It's okay, I'm looking forward to you con con confronting the supervillain directly, one on one, just you and him. <laughs> what are we waiting for then? Let's go! I'm driving the truck inside! <laughs> Let me get on top! <laughs> Alright, we'll all back together again. Oh, yes. They're on a series of catwalks that are over the nuclear fission <laughs> reactor. <laughs> over one of the fission reactors is uh, is the girlfriend that we saw earlier tied up, hanging upside down. I mentioned you were the smart one. I was hoping you knew how to work this place. Is I'm just here. I don't you basically know just pushed a big button. <laughs> that was it. All right. That's Okay. There are signs all over that say hazard. Nuclear hazard, tripping hazard, slipping hazard, heat hazard, coolant hazard, supervillain hazard. How appropriate. Ratcliffe, Slothin, Sl Slothington, 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 Slothington. My apologies. You brought the video equipment? Yes. The broadcast across the city? It's been filming us this entire oh, time. Oh, <laughs> Yes, hello! <laughs> I just feel it looks better over here. Okay. Yes! <laughs> Montage of people around the city watching this view on their television screens. All ethnicities, all rich, poor socioeconomic status. <laughs> it doesn't matter, there's even a Native American in there. <laughs> Island City 2.0 square miles place. We got a message for you. Bart Thug, Ratcliffe, and Slothington are your new mayors. Oh, we're blowing up the plant. You're taking too long. Trying to work here. That was it. That's just, all we needed to, to say. If you wish to save your city, you will send one police officer with money. <laughs> I didn't I didn't think this far. Hundred thousand monies. <laughs> we will give you until twelve AM. The big clock behind uh, both of them is eleven fifty-eight. We know it's a time crunch. <laughs> but now we'll see that's an ice cream truck. That's an ice cream truck. That's an ice cream truck. An ice cream truck. <laughs> I got your monies before midnight! Sucker! That was really oh goodness! Uh, ice cream truck comes through the side of the nuclear reactor. <laughs> oh, oh, away. I'm still on top. Hey, that looks like the main guy. Skids across the catwalk and slams that one guy who's also double cast as the girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> through the wall. Sally. Hey. Save me! My oh, doors yeah. went shut! Slothington! Sloth Go out the other yes, side! Sir. Right. <laughs> Take care of those two. I have a feeling of a date with Sally. <laughs> You're not my type! <laughs> it's just you and me. Oh, and your friend oh, behind. <laughs> I feel like I missed something. <laughs> I accidentally felt up your girlfriend. Oh! And I cut myself loose, you jerk! Oh, Jesus! Get out of here! It's okay, there's no real consequences for that anyway. Slothington, take care of them. I'm gonna get the girl. Ha! 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 Cop brawling school. <laughs> <laughs> Throws him off the catwalk into one of the cooling tower things. <laughs> 
tased him. <laughs> Good job, assistant. Uh, through his chest rips a, uh, a, a blade. No! I never considered the potential impact of bringing innocence with me in my fight on crime. I'll probably learn nothing from this sacrifice. Revenge me, okay? You son of a sidewinder. What'd you do with Sally? I saw her stab you. <laughs> oh, Jesus, she did. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, I must have been in shock. I must have been in shock. I didn't really register. And Sally's fine. <laughs> Along <laughs> with her parents, he taps a monitor, and on the monitor, a uh, uh, display, they're all rounded up uh, with uh, Ratcliffe. <laughs> he, he, made, he made it. So the guy that splattered against the wall? Uh, Ratcliffe is very banged up. He's bruised. Uh, he looks crippled. He looks very feeble. If the three of them fought back, they could probably take him. <laughs> I need more henchmen. <laughs> Master, you are on microphone. They can hear you. Oh! Thanks a lot, jerk. A brawl breaks out on the monitor. <laughs> We're kind of. Hey, did you hear him? Sally's hiding behind you, isn't she? Yes! <laughs> you don't get to take away her knife, I'm gonna get it now! We can Bring take it the family power! Come back, back to the catwalk! Ha! You're defeated, Thug Bart! Bart Thug? Bart Thug. Nobody's gonna remember your name after tonight. Or will they? Five. Four. What's that countdown doing? Three. You didn't even give me a chance to stop it! <laughs> On the number one, it freezes. What the heck? What the... What the blazes? I work here! Slash! <laughs> oh my... Oh! Blood. <laughs> oh, lost my balance as well! Ah, falling together in a poetic symmetry of dark and light, yin and yang. Did I break the cycle of violence into the radioactive isotope chamber where both of them are disintegrated? <laughs> Cut. Uh, well, it's pretty much contained, but God, that, that's a horrible fate. <laughs>